Uh, well, hello. Uh, it's my pleasure and honor to be sitting here with a very esteemed director, Mr. Kaval Sethi. I had the pleasure and privilege of watching his film once again this week, starring Shafali Cha and um, Neeraj Kabali. It's a beautiful film and we're here to talk about it. And of course, your craft in general. Thanks for inviting us. Uh, no, 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 absolutely. When we, when we think about a couple in love from a Hindi cinema standpoint, we imagine two college kids running around the trees singing a song. Uh, so what was the genesis for, for an idea like this, about a couple that's been through so much uh, before becoming a couple? Actually, the, the, whole, the whole thing started with an anecdote from a friend of mine. And he's a famous actor actually in Bombay and he's told me a small anecdote. And I was working actually on some other project. Mm -hmm. which mm -hmm. And it touched me so. Yeah. And it told me so much about uh, the loneliness in the urban context. Yeah. And I was so moved, then I immediately started weaving story around this anecdote. Mm -hmm. So, and uh, it took two years then, mm -hmm. but um, yeah, that was the start of And I think the loneliness uh, was the main thing which gave me the first impulse. <laughs> <laughs> What about the casting? I mean, you have two very, very talented actors here. And, uh, you know, I've been seeing Shafali Shah since the days of Hasratin, back in the 90s. What was the trigger to cast uh, both of these actors? Uh, actually, it was, a, uh, it was a journey also. Um, we had some other actors also in, in, in mind and also in place actually, but a few reasons we, we shifted. But then I met Shifali mm -hmm. and immediately after meeting and actually during the meeting we, we had the chemistry and, uh, and uh, there were a few things which we discussed and uh, which I wanted to have and uh, uh, yeah then it was very clear and same with Neeraj Gabi and uh, was again it was a very um, a decision which was taken very in short term mm -hmm. i met him and actually after the meeting in the evening it was i, I still remember it was in uh, aram nagar in jar pictures office yeah. and in a very small room we were yeah. sitting yeah. and and, we, yeah. and actually we both uh, came after the meeting that we want to work with each other the film has a very dreamy feel and in certain areas where these characters are just in their own space they're just talking and uh, it seems almost like fantasy-like, maybe because it's so far detached from our reality right now. Or the end, the last scene of the movie also is very dreamy-like. Was that a deliberate decision? Were you trying to show maybe that this is a dream for certain people and it's not something that happens, or was it just something that... I choose to write the story, a lot of things happen in the night. Mm -hmm. That gives the feel yeah. of dream, actually. Cool. And uh, the decision to... during the story writing, to put a lot of things in night was also because there's so many dreams which can be dreamt in the night like widow uh, uh, to fall in love again to, with him fall in love again so it is it is it is it is something in the darkness which has to come out so that was the reason uh, during the story writing uh, that i have put many of the meetings which has also organic reasons sure sure uh, because both are working and all those things. You know, coming to the children, because those are the characters I, of course, related with the most. Um, the son and the daughter of Shafali Shah. You have this daughter who's all about getting her mother liberation and you have the son who's grappling with the idea of, of mom moving on. Even if it's a cliche that there's a man who is it's against it and the woman not, but there's something in it that's very often the young daughter, she can understand that the mother is lonely and she, she knows the desires of a woman mm -hmm. and she can feel it more mm -hmm. than the son. Mm -hmm. and, and, and uh, yeah, so that I think that was the reason why uh, that uh, the daughter can feel it more yeah. uh, than yeah. the than the guy. Yeah. Well, what was a pleasant surprise was uh, the hero's daughter, 
who I, I again, maybe because I come from a filmy sort of uh, mindset, I imagine she would throw a fit and say, you know, how can you move on? How can you, you know, and, and for her to be open-minded and very casually open-minded about it, uh, I think it's probably a reflection of where, where, you know, how society is going now and how people are opening up their minds, their minds to things. So you have two, three different kids and you have three different, yeah, or three different perspectives on yeah. the same thing. So, sure, sure, so. sure, sure. हमारा तो मजाक ही उड़ गया लोग पूछ रहे हैं कि माँ बेटे दोनों एक ही मंडप में शादी करेंगे तुम दोनों हो ना मुझे और कुछ नहीं चाहिए माँ के बारे में तो सोच अम्मा ने सोचा क्या सीरियस बात है नाडा For me, this movie is very universal. I think it's something. It doesn't matter where you are in the world. Yes, maybe the degree of uh, uh, societal uh, societal resistance might be different if someone is sitting here, or someone is sitting in India, or some other country. Why Mumbai? I was few times in Mumbai, and there was something. Which I liked about the city and also disliked. It is for me. It is like sadomasochist city. Mm -hmm. it, it it is it is sort of beautiful, but it is also it it, it pains you. It it gives it is like yeah. it is very ugly also. True. And True. Uh, I don't know. Uh, there was something which I want. This was an adventure uh, also to to stay stick with the. Uh, the idea which came first mm -hmm. and stick with that and uh, and have an Indian actor and have uh, the whole story play in Bombay. So. Yeah, But for yeah, me yeah. it was very important to have the city because I, I believe that uh, the space in which we are, mm -hmm. in which we stay, mm -hmm. tells a lot about us. Sure. So, sure. so that's why all the spaces where she is, where he is, they, they tell the moment, they tell the mood in my life and all and the moment so that's why it was important to have uh, those spaces also play a role what is one film let me ask you one one hindi film that's been your inspiration uh, there may be multiple i i, I like the movies um, gulzar's movies there are stories being told uh, with many great actors of indian film industry which are not being told right now sure, sure. so and i actually i must say i'm overwhelmingly surprise mm -hmm. the response which we are getting yeah as so it's crazy and it, it and it is also it, it it's for me proves that uh, we need to make uh, uh, to start with your opening question which is that uh, if you think about love story in, in mumbai setup you normally you think of uh, puppy right. love and all those yeah. which is also okay I, i don't have anything against that's one one of the many forms yeah it's one of the many forms yeah. but in our societies even in india you have different layers and you have to tell stories of this in different layers and why are and the other thing was i hate that we are wasting so much talent we are wasting so much talent yeah. in 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 the hindi film industry oh absolutely uh, making all the such a great actors the mothers and uh, the, and i don't know what and, and there's so much potential yeah so let me ask you what is your advice for someone you know there's several young filmmakers who are scared to take that first step and and make a film um chalegi nahi chalegi will it get into a festival will it not this that um or or the, just the fear of you will i know camera angles will i will my writing work will it not what is one thing they should do and what is one thing they should not do in your opinion i think one thing they should do it that they should stick to their dreams they should uh, they should uh, and um, they should work very hard basically on scripts and storytelling first before yeah. they before they Obviously, go the and uh, do things stuff production that. stuffs and yeah. this is the yeah. one what they never should do is that uh, they should not uh, start any project in an in a very early stages they should they should take time they should take time mm -hmm. to develop the story and and find out i think for me is always very important to find out what the hell any story even if it's a political or a thriller or anything what the hell it has to do with yourself there's a some layer there's always some layer in each of the stories which has to do with you and that that makes you that makes you in the storytelling authentic and that makes to connect to the characters so this is a question which during the process of developing is very important to ask 
yeah. yourself and and I and I totally believe even in a mainstream film mm-hmm. because you you are writing a character which right. otherwise you cannot write the characters do you feel that the son in in the end when the mother gets married and and he hugs her uh during his marriage is there, is there a bit of reconciliation in that it, it, for sure for sure for, that that's very important for me because the journey of this woman mm. Uh, she's a very tough woman. She she is she has worked for 20 years alone. She has yeah. grown up these kids. Even if there is a conflict between daughter uh, between son and mother, the mother cannot stop loving the son. Sure. So so sure. actually she don't makes any compromise. This is this is this is this is uh, the tough this is this is the strongness of this woman. It's a choice. She doesn't give up her son. She yeah. doesn't give up love. Yeah. Because even if there's a conflict between right. them, right. she goes to him. She does. Yeah. She That's she goes to him. Yeah. yeah. So yeah. at the end, she gets both. Yeah. So because because she's not uh, compromising on both. Mm. Mm. It's not just emancipation process. Sure. Uh, uh, I have to love and I have to sure. leave the family. She's not compromising yeah. on both. She don't want to leave the son. She don't yeah. want to, so yeah. and and she sticks to both right. and she gets the both. Right. Excellent. Thank you so much for giving your time. Thanks I really appreciate it and I look forward to the next movie.